Do I trust you? Standing in a black wrought iron fence, her hands gripped the bars while she stared longingly through two spires at the flower garden. The scene panned out and there was only one panel of fence directly in front of her. God walked toward her through the flower blooms. Love, God said softly, you have access to the garden. I can't get there, she replied frustrated. Love, God replied and then paused. There are many paths to the garden. I keep trying. I'm trying so hard and it is not working. Ugh! Her hands clenched on the bars of the fence. Her eyes were closed and she was trying to force a vision. Love, God whispered to her soul. Allow. God moved next to her and asked, What do you see now? Still nothing. I see, I see. God sat down on a tree stump that appeared directly behind her. She spent several more minutes fighting with the bars of the fence. The minutes felt like a metaphor of the months she had been working on her spiritual awareness. She wrestled and wrestled and wrestled with the fence until she fell to the ground in defeat. Love, a house is not built without a solid foundation. If I give you the key without teaching you fundamentals, the roof could collapse. There are many things I'd like to teach you before I activate your vision to a higher awareness. To use your vision, there are some tools I'd like you to have in your toolbox first. Do you trust me? She looked at God like she completely understood, but she had no idea why. Do I trust you? Her soul whispered triggering tears of release from the deepest of places. She slowly walked in a circle around the stump, examining the energy. She couldn't see God, but she could feel God. Flowers sprouted around the stump. She could smell the fragrance of the blooms on the gentle breeze. Her body flushed with goosebumps. Love, there are many ways to experience your intuition, sight, smell, feel, hearing, and more. Open your heart, love. 